Hi everyone, welcome to my first playthrough of Mafia Definitive Edition. We're gonna start with Mafia 1, obviously. I'm Meg, if you don't know me, and if you do, welcome to a new series. I'm so excited. This game has been recommended endlessly. For context, I played through LA Noir somewhat recently, I would say. Like, I think we finished within the last six months for the first time on the channel. I loved it. I loved the detective parts of it. I loved how it was a period piece and learning more about that time. Loved the characters. And as soon as I finished it, everyone was recommending Mafia. So I am super pumped. So I don't know much about this game, but I know it's set in the 1930s. It's about the mafia, I think, in America. And for context, I personally, on my own time, just finished Peaky Blinders season six. And I know it's a different part of the world. It's a different, 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 different thing. But still, the idea of mafia brotherhood, the intricacies of that, I'm in the mood for it, okay? Maybe something to do with fatherhood. I'm into it. So let's go ahead and get started. Thank you so much for being here. Don't forget to drop a like and a sub if you haven't already. It really supports me and the channel. And I'm so excited to be on this journey with you. Green sounds so good. Ooh, I love that instrument. gun like that his items the pictures the smoke from the ashtray the lights outside the warm light you know it is comfy cozy but there's a gun right there and oh damn okay if you know me you know i like to sit in title screens and listen to the full song um i can tell i'm gonna like this okay i'm gonna go with classic we'll lower it lower it if we need to
Polly is such a mafia name. Oh my god, this is so beautiful. Dun Salieri. It's like a movie. Oh my god. Luigi! Don Morello! It's Italian! <laughs> Detective Norman. Look at that subway! Who's our guy though? I need to meet our guy. That him? Okay. Or is that him? It's Tommy. Thomas Angelo. Detective Norman. Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. You alone. Like Peaky with <laughs> binders. No Respecting badges coming in here unless it's the health inspector. What can I get you? Ah, just a coffee. Thanks. Dip your beak. No, thanks. Suit yourself. So, you yeah. said on the phone you might have a proposition for me. That's right. But if you're looking to set up a gravy train, you call the wrong cop. I'm not looking for any, uh, associates. Good. Because I'm on the nut. Can't even pay for the coffee. But I got plenty to trade. Well, let's hear it. How long you been in town? Three years. Three. Caught my teeth in Empire Bay. Well, they handed you the Morello case. Right out of the gate. That's what the paper says, ain't it? And what's it to you? Tough break. Case must be getting pretty cold by now. Or you got something might warm it up. Yeah, I might have some. And what's my end of the deal? Uh, you want money? Some sort of immunity? None of that. I got people I need to protect. Ah, families. Always the Achilles heel, ain't it? So who you got? A sick ma or a wife and a litter of kids? Wife and daughter. A daughter? No one else to watch your back, I'm guessing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Pity that. Pa always said a man needs friends if he's going to survive in this world. Yeah. Well, in my world, it's the other way around. I love his voice, his accent. No surprise there. Ooh. Look, I can't promise anything for your family, not until I hear what you're trading. So, are you talking? Or are you just killing time before they come for you? You think I'm on the run? <laughs> oh, I know it, Tommy. Jesus, look at you. Surely gassed. You haven't slept for days. And your neck's got to be aching from all that looking over your shoulder you're doing. No, the way I figure it is, you got someone powerful mean on your tail, and they ain't giving up until you end up in the river. And you walk out that door without me, we both know you're not making it five steps. Boss, yeah, you stick around, you tell me your story, and maybe you got a shot at living long enough to walk that girl of yours down the aisle. Either way, looks like I'm buying you a cup of coffee. Okay, respect. 
respect detective oh so he's honest no one ever sees the hair pen until it's too late but you didn't get handed the heater in the nursery did you no <laughs> i was a cab driver back in mm, the three or is this gonna be flashbacks oh an offer you can't refuse Oh, beautiful still. Is I mostly drove nights because the money was better. It was at the end of one of those shifts when I first met Polly and Sam. Oh, shit! Tommy's just like, hello? Get up, Polly! There's a taxi here! Oh, It'll um... Okay. <gasps> Choose. Oh, on. shit! We're through. Anywhere. Fast! Okay, I got you. I got a gun pointed at you. They can jump, we're dead. But you don't get to walk away. I don't want any trouble. Well, you got trouble. Drive! How the hell did they know we'd be there? It doesn't matter now. We just got to lose them. Uh, how many cars we got following? One for now. How do I... I feel more. like this is not very far. Or fast. Hold tight. I'm going to try some. Who were those guys? You don't get to ask questions. We need to get over the river. Take the Giuliani Bridge. Oh, okay. Nice. Oh, this is smooth. Leg okay up there. Hurts like hell. When we're back, I'll wake up the doc. I don't know. It might be okay. Just getting the call anyway. <laughs> Polly. Yeah, listening, Cabby. You don't get to listen either. Okay. All I'm doing is taking you guys where you want to go. So yeah. do that. I am. And I'm doing a damn good job of it. Taking you once we're over the bridge. I'm getting tired out of questions. This car is not fast enough. <laughs> it's a freaking cab. Ah, shit. I pressed F. Some shortcuts that'll slow them down. Okay. I don't care how you do it. Just shake them off. Shake it off. Just shake it off. Okay. That was your shortcut? I lost him, didn't I? Not all of them. These guys really don't like it, do they? Sometimes business parking fall out. <laughs> it happens. Quit yapping, Polly. Or he knows. Okay. My bad. Let me try again. Ooh, what a cool, like, death scene, though. Oh, last checkpoint. I know some shortcuts that'll slow him down. Okay. I see. Nice. Okay. That was your shortcut. I lost it, didn't I? Not all of them. These guys really don't like it, do they? Sometimes business markets fall out. It happens. Quit yapping, Polly. More he knows. Uh, so find ways to lose your tail. Um, I guess that's like these little things. So I'm gonna try to go mm, there chance of him not seeing the sun come up. I ain't heard a thing, fellas. I'm sorry. I know some shortcuts that'll slow him down. I don't care how you do it. Just shake him off.
Okay, okay. That was your shortcut. I lost him, didn't I? Not all of them. These guys really don't like it, do they? Sometimes business markets fall out. It okay, so now we're over here, so let's keep going and then turn that way. Let's see if it will work. Or he knows what chance of him not seeing the sun come up. I oh. ain't heard a thing, fellas. Tommy's doing a good job. Okay. <laughs> you left him in the dark. We ain't clear yet. Keep driving. So next one. Let's go down. Okay. Four bastards digging the road for the works program aren't gonna thank us for this. Three crates down. How many motors were at the exchange? Four. Five, baby. No with him, he's called for more. Sure feels like it. Next time we take more muscle. We should have expected trouble. When the boss hears about this, they'll be out of pay. They must have sent word out. There's more and more of them. We're not gonna last long unless we're back on our own turf. Let's get back to the neighborhood. Fuck. Really? Oh shit, man. Trying my best. Trying my best here. Ah, uh, the bridge is up, ain't it? Yeah, we can make it. Oh, my God. Oh, no, you spun me out. To send word out. There's more and more of them. We're not gonna last long unless we're back on our Bro, own why am I this Let's way? To the neighborhood. Okay. West Harbor Bridge can be fast. They're coming from that way, I guess. So Ram must be oh, shit. Why is it gotta be so many cars on the road? Ah, uh, the bridge is up, ain't oh. it? Yeah. We can make it. What the hell are we doing? Just sit tight and pray. Yes! You're lucky you found Tommy. I've never done that before. Me neither. <laughs> okay, so little Italy. Now, your night's not over. Uh. Okay. I, I think didn't he's... see this coming. You think he squealed? I think you zip it tight. We talk it through back at the bar. We're just driving normal now. That was crazy. Okay, we're close. Did it. Pull over in front of that bar. Celieri's place. Yeah, that's the one. Wait here. What for? You want a little something from the Don or not? They're both so cute. I like didn't get a good look at them, obviously. Newsy hat.
I feel like this ain't your first rodeo, Tommy. Mm. Or maybe you were just made for it. Uh-oh. Who's this? Um. Oh! 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 No. 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 Why did... Ugh. Oh. Compensation for your services. Any damage to your car. This makes us square. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Silieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan, or some honest work, don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. Honest work? I was starting to think he was dragged into it, but I don't think so. This matter stays between us. Anyone asked where you got that money? You wanted it poker. Scratches on your car. You swerved. To keep from hitting a little old lady. You got it? No, of course. See you around, kid. I think he might just be someone who can keep their cool and Why have the envelope. I could have had a heart attack. Enough to fix <gasps> the gap. Oh. Nearly enough to buy a new one. I thought about what Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. The money was good, sure, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then. I was out. So he doesn't have a wife and daughter yet. Okay. I'm hooked already. You MFers, I'm hooked already. You knew what I would love this. Wait, did After I actually? Night with okay. Silieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. He has a calling. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie. And other people's thoughts, too. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. <gasps> oh, okay, bitch. Oh my god! I wanted to explore! Jeez. So where to? St. Michael's Church. Directly. Directly. Okay, careful, so this... Careful, please. I always drive careful. Can you be the first? Oh. What's a li oh, okay. To get money. Turn that racket off. I can't hear myself think. Excuse me. That's much better. So, church. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. Damn, this is like pretty realistic. Driving.
fast you can go, I guess. I see, I see. Is there a cab driver simulator? Because I like this. You want in? Would you like to? Looking good today. How you doing? Okay. <laughs> you don't get to bump into me, get it? Here. Oh, it has to be perfectly like this. You know, freaking. New York cab drivers will make me run across the street to get in their cab. Art gallery. Give me that quick. Okay. Sure. Quick I can do. Oh, time remaining. Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much. Just talking. I'm paying you to drive. So do that. Okay. You could have said that in a nicer way. Okay, I'm out there. The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Saw that before the crash. So yeah, I get to be busy. Your busy day is going to be looking at old paintings? I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever hmm. find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Oh my Until god. Then, quit bothering me. Yeah, yeah. He would you. hate me because I am a streamer. <laughs> okay, yeah, the limiter is nice, otherwise, I would speed. Cruise control, baby. I wish I had a timer for my New York cab drivers. <laughs> no, I would die. They were crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm right here. I'm right here. Pull up in front of the gallery. Okay, thank god. Stop the cab. I'll get there soon on foot. Cab drivers in this city. Every fair today's been a son of a bitch. I got there on Other time! The no way. Did he pay me? Over here. Did he frickin' pay me? Fourth and can you drop me Coming in front right of City up. Hall? Um Broadcasting live from It's Paris literally the right there, Show. honey. This is WBDS. Stay with us for more music. Edmunds Tools has all the stock and know-how required to tackle any job that could come up, both at home or in the yard. Whether replacing Thank a you kindly. set or building Anytime. a carport, our staff good knows day. exactly what's needed. And our price guarantee means you won't find what you need for cheaper anywhere locally. <laughs> Edmunds Tools, for jobs big and small, Big Break Reds deliver flavor and satisfaction. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, no. Sorry. Sorry. 
pick up a pack today and find out for yourself. Big Break Reds. This is WBDS broadcasting live from Behringer. Um, is this a street? <laughs> oh, I found one. to turn around sorry that was so close Since five, what's your excuse? Moose. Figures. Where are we going? Little Italy, 21st Street. Okay. If I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the limit. Good deal. <laughs> Great deal. Oh, yeah. Any no alcohol. Today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Who's got the money for a cab rides since the mm. market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I'm drunk and don't know better. Come see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Guess so. If they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. <laughs> This city's corrupt as all hell. Uh huh. Sure is. It really is. So peaceful. I love this. I reserved um, my Steam Deck today, so hopefully I should get that by my birthday in December. Nearly there. Just up here on, on the corner, please. <laughs> on the corner. Hey, my cousin has a coffee stand around the corner. Tell him Lucio sent you. Take a break, huh? Thanks. Might just do that. Aww. That's sweet. Thank you for being nice to Tommy. Whoa, Jesus. Oh. Hey, how you doing, pal? You remember me? No. Yeah. Oh my god. In broad daylight? Uh, Mr. Morello's a little bent. Shouldn't go help in Salieri's goons, huh? Oh my god. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't do much walking for a while. Eh? <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. Okay, here we go. Fight time. Oh, I'm sprinting. Oh, 
Oh my god, good job, Tommy. Nice. Look at this. <gasps> no. Oh, there he is, my friend. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou. You got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there. That's all. Oh, didn't you run this town? That right. Yeah. What well, is he? Is the Don's favorite driver? So anything you got to say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, let me tell you something, pal. We ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. Polly! Give me a gun. Okay, then. See your boys around. Let's go, Lou. That's what I thought. <laughs> Thanks. Least we could do. Come on, let's go say hi to the Don. Don Salieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. Honestly, it's hard not to feel like a sense of family already. Oh, he's an old guy? Oh. Running man. Another one. Molotov party. No, that's done. That's his butler. <laughs> Just kidding, I don't know. What do they call you, son? Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Thomas. Frank told me you ran into some trouble? Yes, sir. My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him. Are the kind of Tommy helping us? This, uh, taxi. That's your livelihood? Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility here. So I'm going to set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab of yours fixed up. Well, I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cab. Oh, he's like, I want in. You hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Frank. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas girls hang out at a bar. Here. Oh, that's why it's called All Molotov. Sure do, boss. Party. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. So smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hardworking Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. Uh-oh, we're getting into some shit. And Tommy, when you get back, we'll talk about what's next for you. <sighs> it's hard because I'm like, yeah, I'm not no totally in the shoes, here. but so tread careful, okay? Sure. Look the around the bar. Nah, you got more time to sit on your ass. <sighs> Don Salieri, I'm writing to let you know of my joy to hear that you will be attending the wedding of my daughter. Interesting that um the detective detective norman was talking about tommy walking his daughter down the aisle please if there are any further arrangements you would wish for let me know it will be a wonderful day and for the world to see that the occasion has your blessing you will make it even more special and memorable your lovely friend giovanni romano find anything Abby. good well, yeah I, i'm watching got it I get it. Lose your job that easy. I hate sitting around. Boring as hell. Boss says you're not ready to come out on collections. Prohibition here to stay. Production and sale of alcohol to remain illegal. In a speech to gathered press, 
President er Herbert Hoover reiterated today that the noble experiment of prohibition will remain in place. Forced to respond to Democrat criticism, Hoover also promised a more efficient and better funded prohibition bureau to prevent profiteering and smuggling. Spoiler alert, it doesn't work. Is that ammo? Nice. Oh, it's a card. The bars are closed for you, I'm afraid. Come back later with Foley or Luigi! Anyways, I got places to be. Okay, come through this way. I'll take you to Vinny first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go see him whenever we need to do any uh, heavy lifting. Came from. He makes sure we're well Sounds healed for when there's trouble. So we're grateful for his dough. We gotta go. Long drive back north. Vincenzo. Buongiorno, Vincenzo. Buongiorno. Ciao, Polly. Ciao. Oh, she's gonna sing. <laughs> Who's this then? Benny. This here's Tommy Angelou. We're doing a little job together. All right. Good, good. Hey, you just need bean shooters or rods? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. I like his enthusiasm. This classic should do the trick. <laughs> <laughs> if the bat don't work out for use, Molotovs. Got a few cocktails here. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> oh. Good to meet you, Todd. Let me know if Paulie gives you the hard time. I'll straighten him out. <laughs> That's sweet. See me later if the boys don't scare you away. I'll fix you with a gat. <laughs> That's Welcome cute. But not in leaves the room. <laughs> no, <laughs> the room. He's a special kind of idiot, but he's got a way with cars. I don't get how this moron gets interested in her. But I'm telling you, it's like some kind of black magic. <laughs> Hey, genius! <laughs> Get your head out of your ass! <laughs> He's loud! You can't, 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 can't just sneak Aww. up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Ralphie. I'm just busting your balls. <laughs> see, 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 you're still a little limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> oh. We ain't nothing alike. <gasps> you got that, Ralph? Polly. Polly, yeah. Tommy. Oh, Tommy, Tommy is a kind Good soul. Like I said, Ralphie here is a crack deck. Well, you bring him a stolen car, he'll make it yours. Tom and me, we got a job to do. We need some wheels. How about this one, Polly? It, it, it ain't a ha 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 rod, but it, it'll get you across the to town. All right, let's go. You're driving. I like Ralphie. And don't let me catch you loafing off again. <laughs> Be nice, One day please. I'm gonna cut your brake line, asshole. I don't He's know what a butt. Trying to pull, giving us this motor. I want to show you something about the good life, and you're driving something my mom could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken out of our yard. Yeah, the car's fine. It's good to get a change from the cab. Yeah, it's not different from the cab. It's a tin can. So, was that whiskey back there in the truck? Yep. New supplier. You guys dealing broad daylight? Normal. Hey, it's their cars we're wrecking today, not this junker. Normally, nah. This was their first drop off. The cops know better than to come sniffing around our turf. Morello, oh, corruption. Uh, he's got a torch. He's got more friends on the force than us. We're okay. Oh. 
an eye over our shoulder. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through, you want a bottle? Just ask. We keep some back for friends. Ah, I'm no big drinker. I used to tip back bathtub gin most days, but not so much now. That stuff's no good for you. You don't have to go blind now, though. To us, you got a line in the good stuff. Wow. Yeah, Thanks. It's crazy that alcohol was time. illegal. It's the places we deliver to. The dames they got in these places. Best table, best food, best skirt. Some way to live. Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wrecked mine. Sure, sure. Besides, all this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble says the guy is about to set fire to Morello's parking lot. <laughs> I got you to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine, try not to let him see your face. Either that, or you hit him so hard they don't remember. <laughs> Yeah, he's definitely getting a little suckered in. But they're kind of like advertising it. They want him, which, ah, it's hard. Like, he looks so lonely. Like, his apartment was just, you know, nothing. He doesn't have a wife yet. He doesn't seem to have friends. And to have this group of people accept you immediately and you're part of that group in a community i can totally understand why these people get suckered in and he even said before they beat him up like it wasn't the same i think he experienced thrill for the first time and This game is so good. That's the first traffic light I've seen. Oh. I don't, I mean, I don't know what to do. This truck's here. What are you doing, dude? We're waiting! Getting on to Morello's turf now. Oh. There's some kind of line between his streets and Celery Street. I was just streets. thinking that. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work North Park. And more besides. You're walking on the wrong sidewalk, in the wrong part of town, you start getting a sense you need to be someplace else. You can feel it long before they start appearing on street corners to stare you down. That's got to be so scary. But at the beginning, when we saw Tommy, he was like looking over his shoulder. Okay, it's close by. Nowhere safe. All right. Smoke and jaw up front and leave their motors out back. There's some lazy bastards. They put some gorilla on guard duty, but it's always some no name schmuck. Come on, over here. You gotta sneak in and wreck the cars. And a message. Sure. Why are you coming with? To see if you get shot. It's a test. Okay. Go Ooh. quiet. You know how to go quiet, right? Yeah, like that. Yeah, he's got his main guys. You'll get there someday. No one sees our heads. No one tries to pop them. This gate and up onto their roof. I'll go keep their chunk busy while you creep up and jump them from behind. Okay. We're real good at distracting. It's the best thing. Uh, most of the guys in the city real pissed. 
actually coming. So I get the money for this in action. Ah, he's good for it. Hey! What the hell you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I mean what I say. What the hell are you doing back there? Who are you? A guy who don't know what idiot told you to keep looking out here. Dino. Dino told me. Dino? Salieri's got guys all over yeah. the Just like that. Oh my god. I wonder if he has a... a past. Now let's get to these cars. Take your bat and start swinging. Oh yeah, baby. Oops. That's great. I think they're going to notice. No one's driving that again. Ah, oh, crap. Hey, get away from the car. Left alt. Okay. Shit. Shouldn't be here. Son of a. He's got some repressed anger. Oh. Use a Molotov and let's see some flames. Love your work. Love the smell of burning paper. <laughs> yeah, Morello's crew would have heard that. Whole block heard that. We gotta go. We can take Dino's car. Oh How my you know god. This is Dino's car. I don't like you, and you got a good car. I'm gonna know where you keep it. Reports of burning vehicles and gunfire in North Park. Smash the window. Right oh, cool. Place. Don't bring in the wrong people. Pain pills. <laughs> Old ways are the best ways. Oh, hell yeah. Straight through the gate. We got to get out of here before the bulls show. I'm reloading. Don't let him get away. Drive. Come back, you Go get it, boys. Oh, shit. We got cops. So, uh, what do we do? You lose them by driving real fast and getting clear of them. <laughs> Sounds good. Right now they're pissed. But let's not get them real pissed. Use mini maps to avoid. Okay. Okay. We lost them. Stay out of sight till they lose interest. Okay. Oh my god, this is fun. Drive careful, Tom. We don't need more heat. A blimp! All officers, search is called. Yeah! Let's head back and see the boss. I thought Salieri had cops on the books. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. Oh. Uh, okay. That's good. How did it feel? Feel good? How'd what feel? Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. <gasps> I guess it did. Oh, shit. No time like the first time, Tom. Uh. Don't get better. You think it's for you? This life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beat motors in parking lots. Eh. There's busy days, there's slow days. I've had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, still enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, knew never to squeal. 
and one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by, mm. and I'm still there. So, I got a suit now, and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I always thought that to be in a family, you had to have more connections. Your brother, or your uncle, or... Oh, some guys, sure. Your cousin got made, or you like Carlo, whose pop went way back with the Don. That means you get trusted more when you're starting out. But there's plenty of us who came in off the street. Oh, chosen family. The then we tip a few. Well, I don't got plans, so. <laughs> sure, you don't got plans. The plans are to feed Vinny so much booze that Luigi has to roll him out the door again. I'm good with whatever. <laughs> sure, you are. Gotta repair this car. I feel bad. Look, Ralphie, what I brought back. Well, what happened to the car I sent you? Out you don't want this one? <laughs> Dumped it. Well, why? Uh. It was a boiler. This one's better. A, b a better car with a b b broken window? Fresh air never killed nobody. <laughs> Um, Polly? <laughs> Ghost Polly. What? <laughs> Still with you then. Somehow. Yeah. Polly! No, this is so scary. Hey, boss. It's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not going to be able to think straight for weeks. See, that's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morello is a hothead. And all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. You got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. Well, thank you, Polly. I, like I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands. Make sure the bills get paid on time. You up for that? Oh, it'd be an honor, sir. Good. Okay. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you. But you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. That's Second, such a random we don't rule. Hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. Okay. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Okay. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. On the payroll. The, line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Salieri. I did not understand how corrupt it was. Then I'm going to only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. There's a lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys in this room... They're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? They're loyal. That's right. Now, you stay straight with me, you're going to be living the high life now. But you abuse my trust. Which I think he did. Uh, Salieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. I think he did. Okay, then. I think he did. But why? Welcome to the family. It's never that. Oh, kisses. Excellent. It's never that easy. Starving. Luigi, let's eat. Welcome. 
Damn, not them the trying to Luigi make me want to join the Mafia. Quicker. But his daughter, Sarah, my own. Sarah! Ooh, I wonder if that's his wife. Days in Celieri's bar were slow. I moved crates and delivered messages. The guys busted balls and told stories from the old country. Mostly, we just waited. I got to thinking, maybe life in Celieri's crew wasn't going to get me clipped. <laughs> but what did I know? Yeah. Thanks. Uh oh. Okay, besties. That is where we're gonna end today. Um, how do I save though? I think it auto saves. I would imagine. I love it. Thank you so much for recommending this to me. I could see myself finishing this in like one go, but I'm not gonna do that because I want to like kind of slow down and enjoy it. But I can tell this is, I'm already having so much fun. I let, I can't wait to get a gun. Sorry, it's weird. But I, I cannot wait to, you know, go pew pew and do more than just driving. But I really liked that intro to the driving and that he has a cabby background because y'all, even though I'm using mouse and keyboard, the driving is pretty smooth. It's pretty smooth smooth oh free ride i guess that's if you just want to ride around i love that but so far i really like this i'm honestly glad that it wasn't like he was forced into the mafia or he was um born into that group because i had the same preconception as him when he was talking to polly like i thought it was just family and in the case of P blinders, that's it's it's family, and it could be way extended family, or I think sometimes you know they marry in and all that. But I really did think it was blood family, so it's kind of cool to see chosen family. I just like it because it's interesting, and it's not that he got forced into it. He is willingly choosing to do this. Like he wanted to get revenge. And he even said it himself that he didn't, like he wasn't gonna go to them for honest work. Um, but even just looking at his apartment before, not this one, um, it was just cold. It looked cold and dark and it just makes sense why he ended up where he ended up. I don't know what happens between then and now. I definitely see what Don Salieri is doing. Wait, is it Don Salieri? Salieri. I see what he's doing with these kind of lost souls or struggling souls. You know, Ralphie, Polly. Um, I can tell that Polly is similar to these guys in the way that he didn't really seem to have family. And he is a bit of like a goofball and a little bit just a little bit odd and I love oddballs but when he was very serious like I'm not like you um because Ralphie has a stutter but you know he is and I think that the majority of the people in this group are gonna be a little bit odd or a little bit lost and Salieri knows what he's doing by offering them protection and safety like who's to say if i was born during this time i didn't have anyone else who's to say what i would have done in that situation you're freaking poor he's probably hungry he's getting shit on by the people like the citizens of the street you know as a cab driver and then all of a sudden you have people who just kind of trust you instantly like they really did trust him and they didn't kill him and they gave him money for his work and bringing them home safe so it's just as humans we really not only do we want community but we need community and with this prohibition era like everything's dark and gloomy the freaking rain you know it makes sense why these men turn to it and that's not excusing it it's just 
who's to say if you were in that situation i know for me if i was in that situation but i like that they're not forcing him into it it's not like he grew up in that he he is making an active decision to stick around beat people up get revenge etc cetera, etc cetera. but you know i love these troubled protagonists i love men like this i love playing video games with these troubled characters you know because it's just it's boring if they're all good or all bad so i'm so excited thank you if you stuck around to the end um i can't wait to play more i think that i will keep this a youtube let's play and not stream it because it just feels feels like a movie and i do want to focus since we're on classic mode i want to focus on the driving and i don't want to get distracted i don't want to risk that so i hope you enjoy and i will see you next time don't forget to like and subscribe join the membership if you want early access all that fun stuff bye love you